Juneteenth is considered the oldest African-American holiday. Celebrations feature rich cultural traditions like music and dance. Even the color red is symbolic as red velvet cake and strawberry soda are staples. And so is passing this legacy on for generations to come. What does the date, June 19th, 1865, mean to you? Freedom, because that's what it's about, freedom. You hear people say, what is Juneteenth? I've had people ask me that, and it's a celebration. The celebration Juneteenth got its name from the month June and the day 19th in 1865, when hundreds of thousands of enslaved people in Galveston, Texas, first learned they were free. Our ancestors were um, prisoners of war. It was free labor. It was raise my children, uh, pick my cotton, <laughs> amen grow the cane, whatever it was that was necessary to make somebody else rich, amen. Juneteenth became a national holiday in 2021, a day community organizer Glenn LaVon Woods had been waiting for. Oh my God, I was a young mother and so I started working with the community when I was 17. Woods is still serving her community today as co-founder of the nonprofit, the South Chandler Self-Help Foundation. We're still here, still trying to make a difference in the lives of young people. The nonprofit, along with the city of Chandler, celebrate Juneteenth each year with the annual Miss Juneteenth Arizona Scholarship Program. The pageant is an opportunity for young black women to showcase who they are, and it's the opportunity for them to grow. I'm Haitian and Puerto Rican, so like I've got really good food at home. 16-year-old Sasha Reveron is Miss Juneteenth, Arizona 2023. I'm interested in foreign politics. I do track and field, and I do a lot of like volunteer work and community service. What do you want to be when you grow up? I want to be Secretary of State for the United States and kind of be involved in that foreign politics. What has being Miss Juneteenth, Arizona meant to you? I kind of got to be the embodiment of the ideals behind Juneteenth and the reason like for the creation of this pageant. If you're just in high school, I'd say do the pageant because it opens a lot of doors and on top of that, it's a good experience to have and you get to learn so many different skills and abilities and you can use those for things outside of the pageant as well. And, and I go to some of the workshops so that I can see the transition. And I saw it with Sasha, you know, and I told uh, Brother Love, who is our president, um, that young lady, she's different. But anyway, I'm, I'm grateful that the Lord has allowed me to be instrumental in somebody's life besides my children. In the community, I'm Susan Casper for Arizona's Family.